when I'm um, curling, depending on the curl, is how you rough the hair around the wand. So for this look, we want it to be a little bit spiral-like. So similar to when you're perming, you know. So this is what you'd create the beachy wave or just more of a soft textured wave. So it's not really too perfect. Kind of looks like their hair naturally could be like that. Um, the way that I do my ponytails, I split the hair in two halves. I never do a ponytail in one section. And reason being, especially someone that she's got, my model has a lot of hair too. So if I had to bring it up all in one section, it can be quite hard sometimes, can't it? Mm. Yeah? What I use instead is something called hat elastic. elastic. So you buy it from a sewing store, um, maybe some grocery stores might even sell it, anywhere where you can buy sewing tools. So the only time that I do say to use the Glimmer Shine really close to the head is it is a good tool to help when you're um, doing an upstyle, like when you're getting it really smooth. So I do spray it a little bit closer because I don't mind it being a bit wetter when I'm gonna when I want it to help smooth the hair. So when I'm doing this, sometimes I um, it's always better to, it's a lot easier, I should say, to get an assistant to help you do this. I'm going to get it really tight, and if you can help it. If you can help it, you can see that the hair is going to stick to the top of the So, thank you. Oops. So you put it over the head, so it needs to go in between the hair and your hand, and your hand needs to stay really firm. One side has to go around the opposite way. This one the other way. And then when you get to the center, you need to pull down really tightly. ถ้าพอถึงจุดที่ตรงกลางละละหมุนซ้ายเสร็จหมุนขวาเสร็จเวลาที่ยางออกมาจะต้องดึงสองข้างให้ให้พร้อมกันนะคะดึงพร้อมกันให้ตึงๆ Sometimes when I do this on dancers they say it's a cheap form of botox อันนี้อันนี้เวลาที่เขาทําให้กับพวกแดนเซอร์อ่ะค่ะเค้ามันตึงมากเค้าบอกว่าเป็นการเหมือนเหมือนโบท็อกซ์เลยเพราะมันด
pull it out a little bit. I haven't got a mirror in front of me, so it's a bit hard, but see exactly where you want it. And what I usually do is once I've got the body and the height and everything where I want it, sometimes to hold the height, I use a little clip to just hold it there for me where I really want it to be. So again, the same thing we're going to do, put it over the top. I'll get you to hold. Can you come this side? Yeah. Oh, just from that side, just so that they can see. See? It's exactly the same thing that we did before. Bring down. When I put a hook, I'll put a hook, I'll get a hook, I'll get a hook, and then I'll get a hook, and then I'll get a hook, and then I'll get a hook. So I like it to be a little bit textured and messy. You can use your comb for this too. And you can use what I like to use sometimes just the gel, just really a tiniest little bit of the gel. Tiniest, tiniest, tiniest bit. Just to not to make it wet looking, but just to get all those little bit of the ก็ใช้เจลเล็กๆเลยนะคะเก็บตรงช่วงผมที่มันจะหลุดออกมาด้านข้างด้านหลังไล่ผมให้มันไม่ดูเป็นเวทลุมนะคะแต่ว่าย